Have you ever wondered what makes China the city to watch for the future in 2050? Today, China is home to over 60% of the world's population living in urban areas. That's over 800 million people, with millions more to join them in the coming decades. The scale and speed of urbanization in China are unprecedented, and it's raising important questions about the kind of cities we want to live in and the kind of future we want to build. But despite the challenges, China is positioning itself as a leader in urban innovation and is already making bold moves to shape the cities of the future. Before we go any further, I just want to thank you for taking the time to watch my video. And if you enjoyed it, please like subscribe and comment as I love building up a community and would like you to be a part of it. China's development has been driven by a number of key factors. One of the most important is technological advancement. China is already a global leader in fields like artificial intelligence, 5G, and electric vehicles. And these technologies are being integrated into every aspect of urban life, from transport to energy to healthcare. Another critical factor is government policy. China's government has made urbanization a national priority and has implemented a range of policies to support the growth of sustainable high-tech cities. Then there's investment in infrastructure. China is spending trillions of dollars on new roads, railways, and public transportation systems, all of which are designed to support the growth of its cities. And finally, there's the sheer ambition and drive of the Chinese people themselves, who are eager to leave their mark on the world and create a better future for themselves and their families. All of these factors are coming together to drive growth and innovation in China's cities, and the results are already starting to show. China's cities are becoming hubs for entrepreneurship, creativity, and innovation, attracting talent and investment from all over the world. They're also becoming cleaner, greener, and more sustainable, with many cities aiming to be carbon neutral by 2050. One city that exemplifies the potential of Chinese urban planning and innovation is Shenzhen. Originally a small fishing village, Shenzhen was declared China's first special economic zone in 1980, and since then, it's grown into a thriving metropolis of over 13 million people. Today, Shenzhen is a hub for tech companies, startups, and entrepreneurs, and is home to some of the most innovative and forward-thinking urban design in the world. From its pioneering use of electric vehicles to its futuristic skyscrapers, Shenzhen is a city that's truly pushing the boundaries of what's possible in urban planning. But Shenzhen is just one example of what's happening across China. Other cities like Shanghai, Beijing, and Guangzhou are also driving innovation and growth and are setting new standards for urban living. Of course, there are challenges too. China still faces significant environmental and social issues, from air pollution to inequality, and these will need to be addressed if the country is to achieve its ambitions. But despite these challenges, the potential of China's cities is undeniable. So what does the future hold for China's cities? By 2050, China's urban population is expected to reach over a billion people, with many cities becoming megacities of 10 million or more. But despite the challenges, China's cities are set to become cleaner, greener, and more sustainable, with renewable energy, electric vehicles, and advanced public transportation systems becoming the norm. They'll be hubs for innovation and entrepreneurship, attracting talent and investment from all over the world. And they'll be models for urban planning and design, showing the rest of the world how to build cities that are truly sustainable, equitable, and livable. In 2050, China's cities will be a beacon of hope for the future, a testament to what can be achieved when ambition, innovation, and hard work come together. What do you think about China's future cities? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to learn more about urban trends worldwide, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future videos. See you in the next one.